It's just another magic mail Monday, oh, we oh. I'm glad it's not a Sunday, oh, we oh. Today is my fun day. It's just another magic mail Monday. So let's get cracking. Hello all my explorers and welcome back to Lauren's Adventures Out There. And if you're new, thank you so much for joining us. We really appreciate it. My name is Lauren and I'm with Castles, Capes and Clones where we discuss everything in the Disney universe. We talk Disney, Pixar, Marvel, Star Wars, The Muppets, 20th Century, Disney Plus, Hulu, ABC. If it's about Disney, we're talking about it. So if you like that kind of content, we'd love it if you would subscribe to our channel. Hit that bell for notifications and do like this post as it really does help us out. Okay, so we are doing a uh, Magic Mail Monday. This is a Disney edition. Most of them come from a Disney something, but the last thing is a Disney thing. So um, we will go ahead and start off, as always, with our pins. So first off, I have this one from D23 Fulfillment Center. And... Um, I had gotten this pin, uh, my friend Seth Lavender uh, pointed out this pin. Um, he really wanted one, he's not a D23 member. I'm like, ooh, I need one, and I, w I told him I'd get one for him as well. So, uh, this is it. We are both uh, big Ant-Man fans, and they are released this set. It's pretty big, I mean, look, it's just almost the size of it's the size of my face, for sure, um, and it's almost the size of my head. Um, you know, the pins obviously are a little bit smaller, but you got um, Cassie in, is it all Cassie? Oh no, it's Cass Cassie, Ant-Man, and the Wasp. Uh, as you can see them there in different states, Ant-Man is much bigger. And Cassie is like regular size, and the wasp is wasp size. And then you got the Pym logo. Um, although in the film, um, uh, Hope buys her dad's company out, and it's called something else, like a Vantadine or something like that. I can't remember what it's called. Somebody leave in the comments below what it's called. But anyway. Seth, there's one of these pins coming to you, and uh, you probably might receive it by the time that I post this. Um, but yeah, that's very cool. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay. Next, we have a couple of packages from the Disney store. I don't know why they came. There was one order, but they came separately. So there's this one, and I already took them out of their plastic and everything so that way I don't you don't watch me struggling with me opening them up but of course first they they're doing these food D's uh, like monthly pins I think and anyway of course I had to get Bernard and Bianca this is a famous scene from the rescuers down under and you know they are my booze I love them so much. I kind of wish that they went, I don't know, with another scene. Uh, th I have so many pins of them in this scene. You know what I mean? But if they were going to do a food pin, I'm glad that they did this one. And I'm glad that they, they included the... <coughs> I don't know what it is. Is it a, a cricket, a cockroach um, with the pea soup? at the bottom there you can see him so anyway that's that <coughs> excuse me I have a cold I'm getting over a cold so um I got like a cough and um my nose is all stuffed up so anyway I apologize 
All right. Next pin is one of the family pins. This one is Star Wars. And this is Jabba the Hutt's crew over here. You got Jabba. You got, um, uh, what's his name? Max Rebo. Um, Sice Noodles. And all of the gang. I love, I love the how cute Jabba the Hutt looks in this. It's like... He's got this, like, really cuddly look and smile. He's so funny. Um, okay, good. I'm refocusing. All right, and then I have this pin. And this is a spinner pin. I'm going to take this off of the, the backer board. So. Oh, uh, okay. I don't know why I, I always struggle with these these uh, backers. Okay, because I believe this is a spinner pin, if I am correct, and I am correct. Okay, so this is from Soul, and Soul is a movie that I didn't necessarily love when it it first came out, but I kind of come to like it a bit. Um, but anyway, that, that's, um, Joe and 22, as they, uh, I'm just trying to hold this in a way that I don't get poked, but you can see that, but that's Joe and 22, as, um, spirits, or whatever they are, and then you spin it, and you got Joe, and I forget the name of the cat, but that's, um, Joe is in that cat, and 22 is in Joe's body, and I thought that that was fun, um, and I think that this was on sale, like, I want to say it was $7.98, and I was like, you know what, I'm gonna get it, um, I'm glad I did, okay, alright, let me put this back, so that's package number one from the Disney store, and next, I will show you the second package. Okay. This is package number two. And we got a couple of pins here um, for the 100th anniversary. Um, Disney's doing a lot of Oswald stuff. And I love it. And I love the fact that they have Hortensia in this pin. Uh, I'm glad that she's becoming more of a household name, especially after having um, gone to L Lunar New Year uh, at Disney California Adventure this year. Um, I just love Oswald. And I know there's people who just kind of, um, you know, they don't want to like Oswald because it all started with a mouse. But, you know, it did. It all started with a mouse. The Empire started with a mouse, but the company existed before the Empire as it is, if that makes any sense to you. Um, Mickey Mouse uh, was... Oswald taught uh, uh, Walt that he should not you know, just give his, his um, products over so easily, like with Oswald, like he was doing it for Universal. He wanted to do it himself, and Mickey was that first thing that he did for himself. And so there's that, but Oswald is still part of the legacy of Walt Disney and the Walt Disney Company, so we shouldn't disclude him or Hortensia. I love this pen. This is really cute. And it's a limited release. And then we have this is Titanic. Because Disney owns 20th Century, they are um, been doing a lot of their, a lot of pins around their IPs uh, in in uh, 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 20th century so this is what the safe looks like and then it's a hinge pin and how do I how do I open this 
I have no fingernails, so it's very hard for me to open up these hand, hand spins. I'm gonna need a little assistance here with this. There we go. Okay, and then we open this up, and we have the what, what is this called? This this diamond, the the heart of the ocean, or whatever it was called. But anyway, that's really cool. I love Titanic, so I thought I really needed to get this pin. So that's very cool. All right, I have one final thing for you today. It's not from a Disney store, Shop Disney, or um, D23, or anything like that. But I got this off of Amazon, and it is another one of the Funko sodas. And here we have Pete, who people forget is as old as Mickey and Minnie. And so there's that. And there he is. And there's a chase. There's This is a 9,000. I don't know what the chase looks like. I never know what the chase looks like. Um, but I'm looking forward to opening this up in a YouTube short. So definitely check that out once I get that posted. All right. Well, that is it. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite uh, pin or soda was. And if you had a good time, we'd love it if you would subscribe to our channel. Hit that bell for notifications. And do like this post as it really does help us out. Visit us on all of our socials down below. And visit our website at www.castlescapesandclones.com Thank you so much everybody and we will see you later. Bye!